one that's worse. It's the just one that's it worse? Is just, okay. yeah. The one okay. that's just Some people worse. say. You answered my following <laughs> question. All right, okay. So the, the problem is you never get to cheat that second turn with the new version, and that's how you get yourself out of a lot of sticky sure. situations. Like, if the, if the combo works, it doesn't matter which one you're playing, right? Because yep. the combo has worked. It's also that you can't start doing, like, some of the... Like, you have to do everything at the end. Yes. You have to draw all yeah. the stuff, then you have to play the 4-5. Yeah, 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 like, yeah. who's going to give you time to play a stupid 4-5? It has to be like everything has to go really well for you. Whereas with the old version, you can like do everything from okay, you have like played one of your completing your quest, mm -hmm. and then you just start going with the apprentices, right? Yeah. yeah. Like you can just with the Kabbal Kabbalist tomes and stuff. Right, right. We've all lost that game, right? Where, where <laughs> they had like zero on the counter or something, and you're like, oh, okay, he's got <laughs> twelve cards left in his deck. Boom, boom, boom. So this matchup. Obviously, much better for Radu. That's why he queued it. But uh, is there any chance that there'd be a Rin lurking around in Echo Wonder's deck? It, there's yeah. okay. 100%. A, no, 100%. a there might be. Yeah, I mean, there, there very likely 100%. is. Right. But your chances of playing Rin, killing Rin, and then playing all the seals before yeah. Quest Mage draws their entire deck is yeah. approximately mm -hmm. zero. Oh, you yeah. might have to siphon it or yeah. kill it some way. Yeah. Like, but the reason why I say it's hundred percent is that he's running the Humunculus version. Like, if you want to have a chance to win the mirror. I'd this version you need to have, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. that's fair. I, I don't see what else he would have in his deck. And I don't see, like, you would not be okay playing a Warlock Mirror, right? Mm -hmm. Without having a way of winning it. Yeah. Ah, free AI. Delightful. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> what a card babbling book is. One of the better cards that you can get in this matchup, for sure. We won't even mention the Polymorph meme. That's, that's, that's <laughs> way dead at this point. What? <laughs> <laughs> That's just how oblivious Crane is. The, the little guy just wants to cast a spell. Did something happen at World Championship once? I don't know. Another arcane intellect. Yeah, re it. remember that. That thing might be about one too many. Being able to rin before they draw their deck. <laughs> okay, I see it's, your point. I see your point. It's pretty much in his hand already. He, he, He's got he, the whole thing. You can kind of like run out of hand space if you get too many cycle cards from random effects. Like I. I don't know if the second AI wasn't one too many. If you think about how much, like, if you ever play Quest Mage yourself, you do get in these spots where you have, like, yeah. hand size issues, and especially if you get the cycle this early, because mm -hmm. you don't have the mana to just get rid of, like, That's true. multiple right. cards. So it's, there's like, it makes it be awkward. There's, like, like sim simulacrums that stick in your hand. There's, like, the freeze effects that you're waiting to use for the right spot. You can have an ice block up and have another ice block in your hand, so you just end up with a ton of cards that you can't use. But I think if you're experienced, you'll work it out. This is yeah. fine for Radu now, anyway. AI. He just, yeah, he just doesn't need to play it. He can just yeah. Blizzard next turn or Frost Nova and then Polymorph and just play everything else bit by bit, and then Arcane Intellect when he's got the hand spin. Hang on. Saying that, I really hope Radu who's put some practice into this deck, because I've just remembered G2 brought this deck to Trinity Series and did not know how it worked at the most <laughs> basic <laughs> functional level. They still won, like, three games against us. Yes, they did. They their played. cards were in the right order. Yay, yeah. Quest Mage! <laughs> I'm actually still a little bit tilted about the game where we play Honda against them, and then they just keep ripping polys on our high mains. <laughs> it's one of these decks that... The People just believe that they can play without practicing it because Zixo was the same in China. He played yeah. the deck, didn't do very well with it, and then afterwards said, oh, I've, I've just never played the deck I, before. I will mm. say, like, the people, like, the environment in the China turn was that people had already thought one step ahead. They were like, okay, so people are probably going to have the, the mate sucks. Anyways, they'll just have quest mates to try and beat these decks and put dirty rats on our decks, right? Right. right. And it's uh, that's, like, how fragile quest mates is. The matchups where you're like, oh, I'm just going to win this every time. Oh, they have a dirty rat? Oh, I'm unfavored. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. E easy. <laughs> I mean, there's things they can do, like, you know, like simulacrum, your antonitis and stuff like that. Yeah. I know. I mean, like... That's not easy, though, is it? It really isn't easy, <laughs> but it's... You know, sometimes people just don't see those kind of things. Yeah. And otherwise, you just have to, like, sit holding, like, a cold light or a novice in your hand just to give yourself a 50-50 that Dirty Rat doesn't wreck yeah. you. But then you're also making your deck worse by play, yeah. playing it, like, in it, like less well. Right. So you become way less favored. And it's, like, it's just very uncomfortable to play against a deck with Dirty Rats when you're playing Quest Mage. Speaking of things that are uncomfortable... Playing the Warlock side of this matchup. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Akka's not having the best time right now, is he? I mean, he doesn't really get to play the game, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That, that's that's what I tried to do in the beginning. Mm -hmm. uh, like, I, I do think like the Master Oak card come when this deck is pretty powerful, but they're just more. 
broken things to do. Yeah, I agree. Because yeah. You, then you have like three nine mana costs uh, cast in your deck unless you only play the one white lord and then maybe Rin. It's mm -hmm. like then you have two three attack minions you can pull. Yeah, I think. But in the Sydney Invitational, like a lot of people brought Master Oakart, and then by the end of it, everyone's like, "Yeah, this card sucks. Why are we playing it?" <laughs> I think it is good. I I just think that there are better things to do, right? Yeah, like, absolutely. It's, I, I I really don't think it's bad. It's just not the not the the best option, right? <laughs> it's another card that adds a lot of difficulty to to playing as well because you have to when you play it. Remember, have I used the Tar Creepers? Have I used the Homunculuses? Have I used the Void Lords? Do mm -hmm. I have Rune in my deck? There's there's a lot to think about before you drop that card. Meanwhile, uh, Radu has auto this game. From this point, he has an ice block in his hand. He has another freeze. He has a sorcerer, a simulacrum, a molten reflection. He has more draw. He has an Antonidas. He has literally everything. Yeah, he can even pull off the simulacrum now. Yep. Which is always kind of nice because. He just needs to not fall asleep. Yeah. Something like that. Uh, so, like, Nova Nova block Simul this turn? He needs to not burn the quest somehow. Or exactly. He needs to get Cold Light out well, of well, first, right? Yeah. Wait, what? No, Simul, they cost uh, two. And oh, it's cost two, yeah. 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 So, so that's fine. That's why you yeah, want to yeah. do it now, so you don't draw, like, a cheaper minion. Yeah, you're right. Get like, some awkward stuff. I mean, maybe there's Stonehill in the Warlock for Duryards? I mean, it's possible. Like, that's an out. Stonehill's right? really good in Warlock now. It's It's gotten a lot the, better the, because... The, the pool got pretty dank. Yeah, like, now you have Rin, you have Void Lord, yeah. a couple of good ones. Even the, the Humunculus, right? As well, yeah. Quite a buff, yeah. yeah. And it's still... I, I don't think everybody will run it. Spoiler alert. Well, I could better be hoping that he is right now. Though, if you're running Master Oakheart, that can pull out. Stonehill Defender. So. Good point. He's going Cold Light. Hmm. It's kind of weird. It's Cold Light Block, I guess. Sure. Yeah, I would have to be more like in tune with exactly the game from his point of view to say whether I like that or not. He probably thought about it. Yeah, yeah, I'd hope so. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, mean it, it's it's fine. He still needed his fourth apprentice from that point, yeah, yeah. right? So yeah, he, he had to draw it. It's just point. it's just that now, like you draw the two mana cost card, yeah. it can yeah, get yeah, awkward. Exactly. So that's why I, I was leaning towards the simul, but I think it's still fine. Yeah. But what's the downside of playing Colette next turn instead? Maybe that he, well, the key. Maybe you can get like more draws for a freeze. Yeah, Probably. that would be one thing I could think about. I, I don't know I just like doing the simulacrum as, as uh, early as possible, especially yeah. how you said it gets awkward yeah. with other other uh, cheap minions. Because like that's how you can potentially lose games like this is that somehow things get awkward. You keep mm. keep drawing two mana cost cards like doom doomsday at the wrong time. Yeah. What do you think goes through like Akka's head? Like, oh, how do I not die? Because I'm pretty dead. But how do I not die? You just gotta, like, you, you just hope that the <laughs> quest mates make the mistake or that Tony's, like, too deep or, or something. Something like that. His hand clocks, like yeah, we talked I mean, about earlier. Honestly, the hand's really full at this point, and you haven't seen them cast home yet. So maybe your out is that they just burn quest with Kabbalah's tome. Like, that's, that <laughs> might just be the highest percentage play for you. Isn't that just a horrible yeah. position to be in as well? Like, you have to keep playing. I mean, rem remember when I said that, like, competitive Hearthstone was all about making your opponent feel terrible? <laughs> that, that makes Quest Mage the quintessential competitive. <laughs> Faster, Wait, though. he has 10 <laughs> cards, right? He has 10 cards now. So this he is does. what I was talking about with the cycle. But he also just has the combo, so it really yeah. doesn't matter. Yeah, so yes, absolutely. It's it like means. the game is over, yeah. But like, say that that was a Doomsayer. What card would he... I guess you could play the Doomsayer. <laughs> yeah. Is there any way this can go wrong for Razu now? Uh, now not. Now not, right? No way. Because he even has a, an AI that would cost zero. Yeah. I guess he needs to finish the quest, but the AI is... Yeah, I'm actually not sure what, what number the quest is on. It's, I think it's five. Four. 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 Oh. It was four like a long time ago. Yeah. My hand is full. It's fine, we don't need that. Yeah, he just, go, <laughs> he just goes off here and he's so incredibly well, favored. That's game over. Yeah. Triple Pyroblast off time. Well, he still what needs to not hit, like, yeah, exactly. What if he... The AI is also generated, right? That's the generated AI from Book Book? No, 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 he's not that already. No, that's a real AI. 
deck of one. Deck of one. <laughs> that could go oh, horribly no. wrong. Dude, dude, that's no. actually went wrong, right? Yeah, that's because he needs to have one mana spare. So, but the poly is created. And yeah, again, so he it's fine. Didn't have to do it that way because you never do it that way. You can never have to do it that way. You can always save a reflection for after. Yep. To proc your Antonidas. But he, he needs to complete the quest first. Yep. Which makes sense doing it this oh way because he needs to discount the. Oh no! This could go really. Wait, what, do you, what do you mean he could save one? So under normal circumstances, oh you have enough mana to only have three apprentices and then play quest, and then the next turn you use your last molten reflection to proc your Antonidas. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sure. This can be really bad, right? Deck of, the deck of wonders hitting like an AOE or well, something. Well, he, need, he yeah. needed to discount his time as much potion. as possible yeah. to reduce the Ca Cataclysm. Fuck. Oh yeah, it can be any spell, can't it? Not just yeah. mage. Good deal damage to himself. Oh. Like oh. oh. Where's it going? It's hit the hey, source princess. Oh! No way! <laughs> oh my god! That would be a good reason to have taken another block turn. I mean, we, we knew it could go. We could see it could go wrong. And well, 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 Radu. Can he still this come is, up with the damage? This is why I play Hearthstone. He's got 18, right? <laughs> He's got 18 damage this turn if he wants it. Oh yeah. So he, he might be fine anyway. But the spell oh, stone yeah. is in Akka's hand. So how many he will get? He'll have two fireballs at the end of this turn. Or... He can draw first, right, with the arcane intellect. He use both yeah. moons. Oh, but though, there's right? the deck. There's the deck of wonders. Oh yeah, that's you. It could go right as well, though. So he needs sure. He needs to needs to sick. He needs to use it right to, to be beating. Oh, he plays three fireballs first and then draws. Exactly. Hopes that he yeah, gets yeah. A, an AOE or something. Exactly. Uh -huh. Well, it just hopes that the two fireballs he ends up with in the end. Or it can be like Hellfire. Like so. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Be anything. An I've AOE, been... yeah. a face damage, a swipe. <laughs> I've gotten Call of the Wild. It's a deck of wonders. He has to decide if he's gonna... he's playing it. Oh my goodness. This is what I like to see. Uh, you have to play, right? You, you need to you need All right. have two fireball. fireballs. Yep. Ooh. Okay. Okay, that's interesting. No. Uh, oh, wait. Uh, well, it didn't say. Uh, uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> um, uh, oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, no, he has enough mana for double fire. But it, oh, but he's dead. He's he's dead. dead. He dies. Oh, he's he dead. do he's one more. One health. Yeah. He's got the ice block up. Akka's yeah. actually going to win this game. Yeah, <laughs> I, I wasn't. Mon I wasn't monkey essing because of the spell effects. I was monkey essing because he was drawing his entire deck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, me too. But I, I thought he had one more. <laughs> and uh, I'm looking at it's the easiest game of RK Wonders life. Very awkward smile from uh, Arjun over there. He just didn't even do anything. Wonder, mate, mate, just press the button. <laughs> just, just press the button. You're good. <laughs> that's, that's how it is, right? It can always go wrong. Oh, man. Well, well, with Deck of Wonders, it can absolutely always go wrong. Okay. There we go. Oh, he figured out goodness. the line. I actually cannot Found believe the lethal. we just watched. That was great. That was very I exciting. Love it. love it when Questmates loses, actually. Same. <laughs> great. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> game two of the day, and we've already made Trollden. So what, what, what if he just, like... Took another turn to block there. Does yeah. he have more like because he had a he overdrew a Kabbalist tome, right? Right. Yeah. He probably could. He had the ice block up. He could have waited. He had he a fireball in hand. Still need to spend afterwards. one mana on the second. But sometimes you would want to do one, like spend one mana on the second Kabbalist tome, right, to, to mm -hmm. get a better roll. I don't know. I don't know. I, most likely he. Misplayed. You'd have to do a lot of maths very, very quickly to work out if you could possibly have the damage from the deck of wonders to kill him. Like how how likely you are. It's it's like Yogg all over again. Well, the, I mean, but the problem is when you when you have a uh, a deck that like solves games when they create one hundred percent one situations, mm -hmm. you generally don't want to introduce variance into that yeah. situation, mm -hmm. right? You wanna you wanna find the line that's one hundred percent guaranteed. Tell that to Kabbalist Tome. <laughs> <laughs> but that's why I'm thinking like maybe just blocking an extra turn was even higher. Yeah, maybe. I think so. It's, it's interesting. Like, if, if there's some people at home who like all, always ha like playing quest mage, disguise toast. Really Tell good us the players, play. Come on. They, they'll they'll probably cringe at something. But no. Rado is like not a quest mage player to per se, right? Toast tells you to play the toast.